no, anyway. Tie up in the center of the ring. Wrist log now by the former light heavyweight champion. Who's not light heavyweight champion now because of Playboy Double H, right? Uh, well, yeah, whatever you say there, you of know. Of course, I wouldn't lie to you. I'd say it'd have something to do with Playboy Double H, Dr. Harvard Cornell, you know, maybe a little bit of Carmen. Well, you know, he does what we tell him to do. Hip toss now by Lightfoot. And Missouri Tiger thinking this one over a little bit. Circling each other now. We're running, we're running Frank out of here. Thank goodness. He's grabbing his philosophy bag and leaving. Man, that smell is about to do me in. Yes, definitely. Hey, I'm going to announce an honest person like Frank Reed in the car dealership. Go figure. <laughs> Side okay. headlock now by the Missouri Tiger. Once again, good, clean, scientific wrestling. Oh, clothesline misses. And Tiger lands one of his own. Tiger Miss now. You know, the thing of it is, I, I kind of I kind of miss that back back from my managing days, you know. These guys are just waiting. They, the guy gets up, and he's like, okay, we'll we'll wrestle and be friends now, okay? Here comes a oh, super kick. You know, it's what they call sportsmanship. And if I've said it once, I've said it a million times. Sportsmanship has absolutely no place in professional wrestling whatsoever. Yes, it definitely doesn't. It, it's more of a sports entertainment ship, you know? Exactly, nor any other sport for that matter. I mean, look at Terrell Owens. He's a great young man. He's a close personal friend of mine. Yep, there you go. Irish whip now. Misses the Tiger Splash. And now can Lightfoot capitalize? There! Oh, oh, pays, oh, oh. pays him back on it good. There. A knife. Those patented Lightfoot knife edge chops. And I think I speak for everybody in the locker room when I say, owie, 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 owie. Ow. Cover by Lightfoot. Count of two, and that's all. Lightfoot stepping up in weight class here to wrestle a bona fide heavyweight in the Missouri Tiger. Tiger's a man who is certainly a contender for the heavyweight title, but, you know, maybe his sportsmanship has gotten in his way sometimes. He doesn't really have that aggressive streak that it takes to win a title, and that's why he's not a champion here there, today. There he goes again, using the, the Sabat-like style there. Taking Jeremy Lightfoot down off his feet now, but he's not following it up. That's the problem there, you know, is he's got to follow it up. He's got to get a little more aggressive on this. He did go for a cover, but it wasn't immediately. I'm glad to see that he hooked the leg, but he wasted two or three seconds to come down there. That was just enough time to recover and kick out of that. And you know, Jeremy Lightfoot, too, former RCW light heavyweight champion. He's um, out here. But, but who's the current light heavyweight champion? Okay. It's Playboy, Playboy Double H. We Play spit it out already. Playboy Double H. Okay. Yes. You, you got You're it. a light heavyweight champion. You're and who's not the light heavyweight champion? You're a light heavyweight champion. Yes, Playboy yes. Double H. Indeed. And, and who's not the champion? The guy sitting up there in the ring there. Oh, old chief, chief running scare. He's not. He's not sitting. He's actually wrestling. Up now to the second rope. Centon off the second rope. Grabbing the leg, it's a two count, almost a three count. He did hook the leg, but it wasn't a determined cover. He didn't have all of his weight on him, didn't hook that head either. That's right, he kicked out of it, got a chance to kick out of it with the free leg there, and live foot now, going up. Oh, Franken Indian! Or Huracan Lightfoot or something. What'd you call that? A Huracan Lightfoot! Uh -huh. Have you ever heard that? Okay, I guess. You've never watched those New Japan videos where they're doing all their high flying moves? I haven't even watched the old Japan videos yet. I haven't caught up with them. I gotta get gotta get some time on that there. Lightfoot missed a knee drop. And now we're gonna see if Tiger's gonna be a sportsman and let him recover. He's gonna, oh, he's gonna go around from that leg. There you go. A bit of an aggressive streak now by the Missouri Tiger. Definitely. The sportsmanship is fine and dandy for only so long, but when you got a big paycheck waiting for you, you gotta do what it takes to win. Right, exactly. <laughs> Right to work on that hamstring and that thigh muscle. Standing leg lock. Look how he's got the leg barred with the tricep. Twisting the ankle now. Working on the ankle, the knee, the hip, the back. Isn't that a song? The ankle, the knee, the back. Wait, no, it's another song. Never mind. That's another song you yeah. don't want to talk up right now. Oh! You know, I am getting Paige with an urgent phone call right now, Butch. I mean, Paige with an urgent phone call. Evidently, Britney Spears is lonely again. I'll be right back. I'll be here finally. You have to get a little bit of a break with Dr. Harvard Cornell. Can't get a word in edgewise or any other way now. Jeremy Lightfoot reversing the whip on the Missouri Tiger now. Picks him up. Tiger goes up with a head scissors now. Flips Lightfoot over. 
Tiger now going for a cover. Lightfoot kicking out. Referee only got a two count on that. I remind you, stay tuned. Later on tonight, you're going to see Brutality Incorporated taking on the Macoupin County Wrecking Crew. Frankie D taking on Corey Twist. And Dirty Dick Brody taking on Izzy Blackwell for the RCW Heavyweight Championship. Here's a roll up. Light foot pin. That's a two count. Light foot up, Tiger up. Both people now connecting with clotheslines. Both men are down. Referee now up to three. Referee now up to five. Good victory lane. Ford here in beautiful downtown Litchfield, Illinois. They have Rampage, Championship Wrestling. Now Lightfoot connects with an elbow. Sends Tiger down to the mat. Tiger getting up slowly. Lightfoot picking him up now. Looks like he's going to go for a snap suplex. Takes him down. Lightfoot rolls over for the pin. Referee goes for a count. It's one, it's two. Almost a three count now. That's what it is. It wasn't quite a three count. It was almost a three count. Now Jeremy Lightfoot stepping in now with a figure four leg lock. You know, I love Brittany and all, but I really wish she wouldn't call me during the wrestling shows. I mean, she's lonely, you know? She's a lonely girl. Are you sure it wasn't Brittany, or are you sure it wasn't one of the production crew? Hopefully it's one of the production crew that looks like Brittany. That'd be OK. OK, well, well, whatever you say there. And right now, Tiger now reversing the figure four on Lightfoot. And now it's reverse figure four leg lock by the Missouri Tiger. We're going to see how bad Lightfoot wants it right now. Lightfoot now, real close to those ropes. He could grab those ropes for an advantage there. Tiger he's not that smart. You know? Tiger's a smart one, and he's the one that went and grabbed the rope. Forces the break. Lightfoot's on his feet now. And now Lightfoot. Oh! Oh, big right. What a left. Oh, that was left. Hand. I'm you sorry. Know, I've said for years that Butch Fletcher doesn't know his left from his right, but Jeremy Lightfoot now going to town on the Missouri Tiger. And now. Twisting the ankle down on the ropes now. This is uncharacteristic of Lightfoot now bouncing the leg down on the rope. Indeed it is. We've seen both men let sportsmanship go out the window here, and I'm glad to see it for one. Actually, they're not letting it go out the window as much as it's just kind of a. Kind of Fluttering a away in the there. breeze? Are you Fluttering trying to get illiterate breeze, on us I guess. Here? Right. Illiterate? Get illiterate on Yeah, I don't You've know. You've been illiterate for. Oh, what a kick to the hamstring. And the Tiger. Can he take control right now? Look out, spinning to him again into the figure four. He tried it once already. Oh, there it is. The figure four, now it's... Count of two and that's it. He almost got him on three there. And you know, that's a real danger of the figure four leg lock. It's known as a submission hold, but a lot of times you can be in such pain that you don't realize your shoulders are on the canvas. Or even sometimes you'll pass out from the pain to get pinned that way. That's right. I believe, I, I can't remember who it was. I seen one time actually passed out from the pain of a figure four leg lock. And a lot of Ric Flair's early title matches that happened to his opponents. Exactly. You see, that's why I'm the number one sports analyst in the country. I know things like that. I'm like John Madden with looks. All right, there you go. Choking him down to the second rope. Again, very uncharacteristic of the Tiger. Tiger now oh! down on Lightfoot. Shades of the Russian bear, Ivan Koloff, driving all 239 pounds into the back of Lightfoot. Into the ropes goes Lightfoot. And if Tiger would have been a little bit more conscious of his ring placement there, he could have pinned Jeremy Lightfoot, I think. He could have pulled him back and took him definitely on that because that would have been... Uh... That would be quite a coup for the uh, Missouri Tiger, too. That's where he needs a good manager like me or even a mediocre manager like you. Oh, yeah. and a small package. Hey, Harvey, I got your mediocre, OK? Count of two. We'll get into that. Well, anyhow, life up with a small package, and it's a shame at this point that we don't have the RCW expert on small packages, Frank Reed, here to count to analyze that maneuver. Yeah, actually, I wonder where Frank Reed is right now. Oh! Okay, hit him with a look Face like first a... to the canvas, kind of a twist of fate. That is it! He got him! Great 
big wig.